Hello everybody. Well, this is a quick overview of the new Rayware um, software. This is the new version. First of all, you will see um, obviously a bigger platform uh, for the Pro Printer, which is kind of nice um, now that we can put more models in one single platform. The printer is quite nice. It will not let you, the software will not let you take the models out of the build platform to avoid any mistakes. You have the same options um, as you previously do. Um, you will have options of scale, layout, and support. But uh, in tools, you will see uh, a new function of repairing the model, which is kind of nice, meaning that you don't need um, a third-party software for this anymore. You can put a model in there, and the software will automatically repair it. It will also let you export um, any models that you have there as SDLs. If um, there is a potential error for printing, the software will let you know as well, which is kind of nice because it will let you know what's the, uh, the sort of the problem and a possible solution. You just click in there and it will automatically give you um, a solution for the problem. If you see um, in there, it will add a base automatically. And the base is kind of nice because now the base is generated. Like if you see it from, let me turn it from this way, you will see it's generated with a bevel. It allows for easier removal uh, from the build plate, um, which is, is, is really helpful. Sometimes it's really difficult to get the models out of that. And I've noticed at least with the prop printer, is uh, way easier to remove the models. I don't know what they did different, but it's way easier. Um, it will let you uh, also jump between printers and different resin profiles really quickly. You just click in there and you can change the layer thickness, resins, everything. Some of these features um, will, as you will see, they will require a premium subscription and uh, you will need to register honestly i don't know if there is going to be a fee associated with it hopefully not but the nice thing is that you will be able to store different files in the cloud to have access to them later which is kind of nice well i hope you guys like the video and uh, we'll keep posting some of this information later